So I feel like I haven't did a flashback review in a long time. But I'm back to review a movie, one of my favorite law movies, Primal Fear. Now Primal Fear follows an arrogant, high profile lawyer who's volunteered to defend a young man who is accused of killing an archbishop. Now this movie stars Richard Gere, Edward Norton, and Laura Linney. Now Primal Fear is one of my favorite law movies. Now I put it up there close to A Few Good Men. The reason I, I rank it so high and close to a few good men is because even though a few good men you have the star power of Tom Cruise, Jack Nicholson and when you mention those two actors that's all you need to be said to go see you in the movie. Even though it doesn't have the star power of a few good men it makes up with it in story. Now when I watched this movie after an hour or so watching it I thought this movie was predictable and that's why you never judge that's why you watch the movie to the end because this movie lets you to believe that this movie is predictable and it's everything not. This movie is clever. And this movie stars, like I said before, Richard Gere and Edward Norton. And Richard Gere is one of those actors that, for me, you can never see him give a bad performance ever in the movie. And this movie just suits him. He did a phenomenal job. But the standout in this movie is Edward Norton, who actually got nominated for Best Supporting Actor in this film. And he definitely deserves every bit of the credit. Watching Edward Norton in this movie shows that he has acting range. He can do any type of part he wants. And he was just phenomenal in this movie, hands down. I'd definitely like to see Edward Norton do more of these type of roles in the future. And like I said before, this movie is clever. It's not predictable. It's one of the best low movies that you'll ever see. And what I like about this movie, like I said before, it's not predictable. It leads you down a story that you think is going this way, but it's actually not. And that's why I like the cleverness of it. And I like Richard Gere in this movie because Richard Gere has a type of performance in this movie that is not too over the top, but yet it's still great. And I think he, Richard Gere is one of those underrated actors that can give that can always give a good performance and not be over the top with certain actors we see today. When I first saw this movie for the first time, I said, wow. Because like I said before, watching it for the first time, I thought it was predictable. But watching it to the entire end, it's nothing. And I honestly say Primal Fear is one of the best law movies that you'll actually see. Now I haven't seen The Killer Mockingbird, but Primal Fear still would be in my top three law movies of all time. It's just that good. And you see the heart of it, you see the story, and you see the cleverness of it. It has great acting, good direction, and a phenomenal story. So with that being said, I'm probably going high on this, but I don't care. Primal Fear gets five out of five stars for me. If you guys haven't seen Primal Fear, I highly recommend you guys seeing it. So, if you like this review, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, Movie Nation.